11 minutes after 8 o'clock. Welcome back. A terrific festival coming up not far from where we are right now. Down in Lancaster, it's a great festival. It's the Red Rose Festival. And Rhonda Fortune is here. And Joe Timmons here to tell us all about it because it's big, isn't it? This is, what, the seventh year, and it's just grown by leaps and bounds every year. How would you characterize it, Joe? Um, it's a hometown festival. We actually have it in our downtown area. Mm -hmm. And as you said, it's been growing every year, and next year we're looking to expand. But we're not moving out of the downtown area. We just are going to take over some more streets. <laughs> uh, oh, you're going to take over some more streets. And you're going to need a lot of streets mm -hmm. to, just to accommodate all the bands that are, that are going to be there. Rhonda, tell us about some of the bands. I mean, you've got such an incredible variety here. We really do. Uh, Friday, we're going to kick it off with a local favorite called um, Shiny Pines. They're going to be followed by um, a rock group from Myrtle Beach known as the Mark Roberts Band. Ah. Saturday, we're going to be starting off at noon with Summer Days. Uh, Summer Days plays a variety of music. After Summer Days, we're going to have the Lancaster Shag Club uh, teaching those who are interested how to shag. And Ooh. that's going to be preparing <laughs> them be good, yeah. for the next two bands, which is Carolina Soul Band, whose name Ooh, says it all. Yes. Uh, followed by the Tim Clark Band, which is which is a premier dance shag party band, and after that we're going to have Gaunt Fiction, who is a '90s <laughs> band, and we're going to end it with Summer Days oh, and they, Outshine. I mean Outshine. I'm sorry, <laughs> yeah. Outshine, who is a modern uh, country with a rock feel. Oh my mm -hmm. gosh, the band, just the music alone will be reason enough to come down to the festival. But there's so much more about what's going on. Mm -hmm. So what else? You've got a race going on, uh, a road race. Tell us more. We at, On Saturday morning, we actually have a 5K that will start at 745 with the Tot Run. Mm -hmm. And it's done by our local charity, the uh, Rotary Club. Mm -hmm. And then we also have a Red Rose Festival dog show where we're going to have tons of different things at 9 o'clock. And then at 10 o'clock, we're actually going to open up with Zumba. So you can actually do Zumba on Main Street. Oh, wow. Um, and we also have games, free. Uh, the whole thing is for free. We have arts and craft vendors that will be there. We have so much going on. Um, and we actually, on our website, has a lot of other information as well. We actually have a summer kickoff reading with our Lancaster School District as well, where they're giving away 18,000 books to local children. All right, so. I want to make sure we don't run out of time here. The oh, website yes. is? The website? www.lancastercitysc.com. All right, you got that. And it's going to be May 20th and 21st. Mm -hmm. That's a week from this Friday. And we're going to have terrific weather. I know it's an easy drive to Lancaster. It is. And it's a mm -hmm. wonderful festival. You're going to want to be there. So we appreciate you all being here. We'll put some more information on WBTV.com as well. Rhonda, Joe, thank you so much. Thank Good you. luck with the festival. Thanks. It's going to be a lot of fun. Good food down there, too. Oh, yes. All right, 14 minutes after. <laughs> After eight, we'll be back right after this.